common rubbish here at Glasgow, but thank goodness most of it has actually been taken away. This could be far, far worse. But what's more extraordinary is this. This tent, perfectly good looking tent, perfectly good looking pair of shoes. I look inside, this tent's abandoned. Complete their beds and everything. They probably bought it just for Glastonbury. Now it's totally and utterly abandoned. It is amazing. But that's it, they've done what they needed to do. They've been here at Glasgow, had an amazing time, got no doubt absolutely hammered. And now it's like I'm in a ghost town. This whole massive tent, totally and utterly abandoned. This place is utterly, utterly extraordinary. Look at this. Utter, utter abandonment. Who'd behave like that? Look at that. Look at the details. All the rubbish, the actual tent, the airbed, everything. The person who lived here is just literally up sticks and walked. In other areas of society, we absolutely frown upon this and we say how disgusting. Yet here at Glastonbury, people still use this mentality. Glastonbury, this place full of unbelievably free thinking, intelligent people, talking about climate change, talking about extinction rebellion, yet you still got this mentality. It is incredible and astonishing. And everywhere I turn, there are places just like it. How can people still think like this? No doubt the person who abandoned this has been walking around all the weekend going on about, yeah, the state is ruining everything. It's ruining everything. No way. Look at this. This is what's ruining everything. We as individuals thinking that this is all right.